Hello, howdy, and hi, I'm the Awesome Fossum. In this week's video, I found a special gem that released all the way back in 2019 that I've never heard of until two days ago. And I decided to give it a shot in hopes of maybe figuring out why I've never seen it before. Maybe it's a matter of bad marketing or simply a bad game. Or it could be genuinely good, but few people either know about it or even play it. If you're also wondering the same thing, don't worry, you're in the right place because we're about to figure this out together. If this is your first time stopping by and you enjoyed today's video, let me know by leaving a like, comment donkey nuts if you're paying attention, and subscribe to the channel. Enjoy today's video. place, a rich and prosperous island, home to a busy trading port. But that was not meant to last. It began when strange formations like giant soil tracks started to appear across the island. No one was able to explain how they were made. Soon after the formations appeared, earthquakes followed. Weak at first, they grew more frequent and more violent. A few days later, three volcanoes erupted in the island lagoon, hurling stones, sinking ships, crushing buildings. Captains feared for the safety of their vessels. All trade stopped. People left Adranos aboard fleeing ships. The brave few who had remained soon regretted their decision. An enormous volcano that lay dormant for centuries erupted flooding the island with a pyroclastic wave, covering it with lava and hurling stones miles away. Those who had made it to the ships were evacuated, myself among them. What we left behind was an apocalyptic landscape of fire and dust. Periodic eruptions turned our beautiful home into a hellish nightmare, disrupting both naval and aerial traffic for years. Despite their best efforts, not even the best imperial geologists were able to explain the volcano's sudden appearance. Several years later, exiles from Adranos secured funding for an expedition to return to the island and discover what happened. It was my honor to serve as the captain of the Archimedes submarine. As we surfaced a safe distance from Adranos' shore, we knew that this expedition to reclaim our homeland had only just begun. How interesting. So this is a steampunk survival game. Oh, okay. We're already in. Is there a tutorial that I have to play or? Whoa, what? Well, this is pretty cool. So wants me to come talk to this guy. Crafted drill strip. Drillship core. Good day, sailor. The time has come for you to start your mission. This island has been taken over by cogs. Hostile robots with technological power that could only be dreamed of. Until now. To be able to fight and defeat the cogs, we must first re reverse engineer their technology to improve our own equipment. The cogs travel in these huge, monstrous machines known as drill ships. You will need to capture one for yourself to be able to move more efficiently around the island. So this is, I'm liking this art style so far. It's pretty simple. Okay, I think I spoke too soon. That's a lot of old work table. I can make a bunch of different things. So what does it want me to do? It wants me to open this up, go mine some ore. This is a pretty game. It's pretty, pretty cool. Nice, nice views. Sort of village here. It wants me to mine. Apparently there's going to be a volcanic eruption in 12 minutes and 42 seconds. So there's stamina in this. Wants me to return the submarine. Okay. Yeah, let's do that. Whew. 
Claim drill ship. Here's your lucky day. So you want me to claim something. Hmm. Very, very interesting. Okay. You heard on you, buddy. mine now. Guess I'm gonna go under from the eruption, because I have to. Interesting. Whoa. That's a it's a big eruption. This is, uh, this is interesting, uh, to say the least. Uh, um, I think I'm gonna play this for a little bit, a little while off camera, get a grasp for the game, and I'll, uh, I'll be back. Two hours later. Alrighty, and we are back, boys. Decided to take the day off yesterday. Oh, what's this? This is, oh, it's sulfur. Modules. So it wants me to. I just mined a few resources. I went and grabbed some scrap and stuff uh, that it wanted me to grab from over there, where I got my thumbnail as well. Uh -huh. da -da -da -da. So this is my home now, I guess. This is like the home base. You can actually, it moves around the map. You can go underground with it and all that. It's a giant drill, which is pretty cool. Um, very interesting concept. So I've played this game for like two and a half hours, eh, a little bit over that now, two, 2.5. What are those noises coming from? Uh, I just want to go down the ladder, thank you. Uh, it wants me to go underground. So, as we wait for that to happen, for whatever reason, um, I saw some armor. It, I don't, I don't know why it wants us 
it wants us to drop. Let me grab some of that stuff. See, see, you can go around the map, like, underground like this, kind of like, uh, I don't know, it reminds me of, uh, the Underminer. From, whatchamacallit, The Incredibles 2. Or the, well, the video game more so. That was a good game back on the GameCube. Oh my god. Uh, but, it's so crazy to me that the Incredibles 2, like, that movie never existed, but the game did, and it just made up for, like, the whole need for a second movie. It blows my mind. Okay, we'll take that. It says there's, like, eight minutes left. Uh, what part of the map? It's kind of weird, because I can't really just go through the lava, I don't think. I don't want to try it, at least. This right here. Oh, am I gonna fit? No, no. Oh, oh, there we go. Just gotta find that hole, boy. I tell you what. question mark so apparently it's on a timer i guess on normal which is all i can, I can get more low never mind uh on normal like the thing is 25 every 25 minutes the volcano explodes and you have to go underground and uh you can watch from a periscope if you really want to um the destruction take place but that's about it. What, what else is down here? And I, I can stop driving and just kind of just sit under here and chill in the base, but who wants to do that? Okay, so. another drill ship okay well let's uh let's go back i can actually i so i'm under the impression that i can take a multitude of what's this here they wanted me to come over here so i guess okay so oh there's a drill ship from earlier Some robots there. Like, okay. Go kill these motherfuckers. I guess not, never mind. My turrets took care of them. Shotgun's good. I should probably get back to base so quick. It's gonna bust. The ground, it's going to bust all over. Get me back! Get me back! I have to fucking go. Oh, I'm out of stamina, damn it.
Hey, nice. Look at that little logo. My little uh, channel logo. Oh, dude, that's such a cool little feature in this game. You can put any picture you want for your little company logo. I love it. It reminds me of like a Team Fortress 2. Oh my god. Being able to put a PNG on the wall, like a spray paint. It's cool. Okay. Uh... Oh, somebody fucking barked here. No, I can't be here. That's funny. Okay. Well, anyways. Who is that fucking coal? I'll take that. Thank you. I'll take some of this copper one on. Alright, let's go here. So I'm hitting the surface now, sweet. Is it over here? Whoa. This trippy dude. This is a pretty game though. <gasps> There's a mine shaft down here. Oh my god. This is kind of freaky. I don't know how to feel about this. Oh my god. <laughs> Jesus, dude. That scared the fuck out of me. What the fuck? Dude, your character having a fart in this game is a... Uh, in the tunnels? They really thought about that? That's fucking crazy, dude.
Okay, so apparently... I'm gonna need to... Uh, build a... Power plant. However the fuck I do that. I don't know. There it is, I found it. How did I miss that? No way. No way. I died? Oh no. Not cool, man. Not cool. But, oh, dude, this is. This can't be possible. This can't possibly be good. I'm fucking juke you out, bitch. Uh oh. Ow. Ow. Oh my god, this is huge.
Okay, I kind of got to hurry. Okay, I kind of got to hurry. I'm so dead. I'm so dead. I'm so dead. Damn. No. No, that did not just happen. Please tell me that did not fucking save there. I'll get it fucking next time. Yeah, I'll get that shit next time. That shit was hard. Motherfucker actually locked me in. It's crazy. Alright, gotta go. Gotta go. Get the fuck out. Alright. A little cheating there, I guess. If I had to assume. But it was worth it. 
I did not know. Dude, that's so cool. What? You can build like a giant ass fucking bug. Oh my god, that's amazing. Don't you look at that? game man I must say so myself look at all those fucking turrets I want to get out and look at this anyways I want to look at this damn that's pretty dude little logo on the back hell yeah it's awesome man so you can get this really long, in other words. That's really cool. Um, I just heard them take off from what it sounds like. After playing the game over the past few days, I've come to the conclusion that this game is actually awesome in my book. I would genuinely recommend this to anyone who hasn't played it yet. I'm not sure why this game doesn't have a bigger player base, if I'm going to be totally honest. Whether that's... Not many people have heard about it, or if it's, I don't know, maybe a small development team. It's just the progress of the game is being developed slowly. I, after all, I'm seeing this is in 2019, so I have no idea. But I do genuinely recommend it, and it's a good game. So I hope you enjoyed today's video, and I'll see you in the next one.